say that it's too late for us now? Why do we stay when I blame you for the things that weigh me down? Hey family, it's the Mobile Home Diva and in today's video, we are going to be touring this home right here. This is a live oak home. It is called the Dakota and I'm so excited to show you this home. I got a feeling it's gonna be a good one. So come on, let's go in and see what this home looks like. This is a live oak home and it's called the Dakota. Three bedrooms, two baths. Awesome, beautiful. All right, I'll leave the door open. All right, so we just walked in, really nice. So this is where we came in from. You've got your living room right here. Love the gray walls, love that it's whew, drop wall throughout. Really, really nice, really nice. So this is all the space that you have in your living room. You've got a ceiling fan up there. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Next to the living room is your dining room. So that is what you see over there. Love it. So, 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 so nice. So I love the gray wood look in here. Love the rustic chandelier. Lots of space in this, di in this dining room has a little separation by that wall. Really nice. Really, really nice. Lots of space in this dining room. So that's the dining room and the living room right there. Really nice. Now the dining room and living room overlook the kitchen. So you've got all of the space is the kitchen. Really gives it, whereas most homes, the dining room is next to the kitchen. This gives you the chance to have a much bigger kitchen. Love the butcher block countertop in this island. You've got a plug in the island so you can plug up any appliances. You've got lots of drawers and cabinets. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Love the little window up behind the sink. Got a little tile work behind the stove, which is really nice. You've got open shelving up top so that you can have additional appliances or decor. Really nice. Lots of storage space. There's a shelf, excuse me, there is a drawer for every cabinet, which is always nice. Black appliances in here. You've also got counter space in the island. Really, really pretty. I love it. I love the flooring. It goes well in this home. Really nice. Really nice. So from the island, this large square island so you can see the butcher block it's really thick which i like and from here you can see into the living room and into the dining room how nice is that you also have this pantry love the door the distressed wood look of this door love all the how the shelving goes around so you have even more space for your pantry items. Always a plus to have a pantry in the kitchen. And if it's messy, you just shut the door. How nice is that? Love it. Love it. All right. So to the left here are the guest bedrooms. Let's go take a look. Ooh. 
This first door to the right is the utility room. You've got cabinets in here, a rod for hanging clothes, over the washer and dryer, always a plus. All right, and then you've got a sink in here. It's a really deep sink. Really nice. So that's your utility room. Okay. And then you've got bedroom number one. Got a cabinet in there. Excuse me, a closet in there. And you've actually got um, upper and lower shelving, which is nice. So that's bedroom number one. Over here, you've got bedroom number two. That's your closet. So that's bedroom number two. Across from bedroom number two, you've got this cute little cubby hole. This, you can put your computer here. The kids can do their homework. You can do your bills. You've got cabinet space and up at the top and drawers at the bottom. How nice is that? Already built in for you. Really nice. And then next to that space is your guest bathroom. If you're, you got your sink there. Your mirror. And of course your tub and shower, but behind the door, you've got storage. Okay, so you've got three units there that you can put extra storage. Really nice. So that is the hall. And you've got your shelving, your uh, desk area there. Bathroom, two bedrooms and then your utility room. Really nice. Let's go see the master. The master's on the opposite side of the, ho of the house, um, right down beside the pantry. This is your master. Really nice. When things are in here, it's kind of hard to really see how big the room is, but it's a pretty nice master. You got your master closet. I'll try to get over here past all the siding and stuff. But this is your master. You got upper and lower shelving to hang your clothes. And then you've got the upper that goes around. Really nice. Show you how big the area is. Really, really nice. All right, so that's your master. <sighs> Okay, let's go check out the master bath. So when you walk in, you got this master ba uh, bathtub. You've got stonework to walk up into the master, the tub. You've got a window over the tub. You've got your shower there. It has a bench in it. Love that. Love the tile work in here. Rain shower, shower head. Really nice. And you've got glass on either side. So pretty. 
You've got your double sinks here. Lots and lots of shelving and, and cabinets. You've got two sinks and, a, and you've got a makeup table here in the middle, really pretty. And then your toilet is on the other side of the sinks. Really pretty. Really nice. Okay. So now, again, this is Dakota. It's a Hamilton home. It's a three bedroom, two bath. This is 1,500 and eight square feet. This home is made by Live Oak Homes. It's $81,900, $81,900. You can't beat it. Love, love, love the price. All right, it's at Yes Home Center in Byron, Georgia. All of the information will be in the description box. Thanks so much for watching The Mobile Home Diva. say that it's too late for us now why do we stay when i blame you for the things that weigh me down